Acceleron is a company that focuses on protein therapeutics that affect the uh, body's ability to repair and uh, heal its tissues. Our products have been discovered here internally in our own laboratories, and these products um, affect a number of processes, such as the production of red blood cells, the increase in muscle mass and function, um, improvement in bone, as well as the uh, inhibition of blood vessels for angiogenesis for the treatment of cancer. So over the last several years, uh, we have developed and introduced into the clinic uh, four of these drugs, which are now all in clinical trials. In addition to Lespatharcept, we are also developing Sotatharcept. Sotatharcept is a molecule that can not only improve anemia in patients, but can also improve um, a number of other conditions. Uh, we are studying Sotatharcept in chronic kidney disease. These patients suffer not only from uh, an anemia, but also from a mineral bone disorder in which they have accelerated bone loss and also profound vascular calcifications leading to an early cardiovascular uh, death in many of these patients. Uh, data that we have presented uh, from our phase two trials of sotatharcept in chronic kidney disease patients have shown an improvement in bone mass in those patients, but also a decrease in the vascular calcifications in those patients. These effects can be quite um, profound and helpful for patients who are suffering from uh, this disease. We are also developing Delantercept, which is an agent that is being studied in certain cancers. Uh, Delantercept is a drug that can uh, inhibit angiogenesis. Uh, in that context, it can work in combination with other agents that can block blood vessel formation, such as the vascular endothelial growth factor pathway inhibitors or the VEGF um, pathway. Uh, we are studying Delantercept in combination with Exitinib in a phase two study in renal cell carcinoma patients. We recently completed um, part one of this study and in 29 patients we're able to show a response rate of 25% and uh, this response rate compares quite favorably to a historical response rate of only 11% of single agent exitinib in this patient population. Based on those uh, encouraging data, we proceeded into part two of that study, which is a randomized placebo control trial of Delantercept plus exitinib versus placebo plus exitinib, and that study is being conducted in 130 patients. We expect that we'll have data from that study uh, next year in 2016. And our fourth compound is ACE83. This is a very exciting compound that can increase muscle mass by being injected into selected muscle groups and acting in a local fashion. We're currently conducting a phase one healthy volunteer study of ACE83, and we expect that we'll present data from that study uh, later this year.